Playboy Carty has finally um, updated us and let us know that he's dropping a new album. So that should be coming very, very soon. We have an update based on his Instagram. He decides to upload the picture. I'm assuming it's the album cover. We haven't really got um, details of it. He just, you know, as he does, he tends to usually let his work do the talking. So not many details have kind of come out there. But this is what he posted on his Instagram the other day. I think just yesterday, actually. Um, it's a cover. It looks like it might be the album. It's him sort of, you know, on the floor, uh, on his knees, um, the silhouette of his. So I'm assuming this is going to be a whole lot of red. Um, it could be a single. We're not really sure what the deal is here. But um, after waiting nearly three years, it seems like, from since, uh, what, not self-titled, since Dialit dropped. Is it three years, I think? When did Dialit release? Uh, Dialit release date let's see the yeah so it's bloody hell 2018 yeah so it's nearly three years now since he dropped that um so looking forward to seeing that <clears throat> when that comes out hopefully very very soon <clears throat> again loads of um, leaks have come out i'm sure most people have heard a few tracks that are going to appear on the album but i've tend to do away with leaks i'm not really a big fan of listening to them usually they're low quality usually it's just people you know usually mostly it's kids who are just looping a snippet to make it sound like a track when it's not really or it's something that's been recorded off of someone's iphone or it's just a reference they're not it's never close to the actual fully realized product unless you're ripping it directly from his performance which might be some you know um, avenue to go down but <clears throat> considering what i read during a weekend interview the other day weekend mentioned that I think I forgot what song it was, but it was a song that he performed live that essentially ended up getting leaked and ended up being one of his biggest singles. But he ended up making 67 different versions of that one single um, because he was trying to recapture or um, what do you call it? He was trying to replicate the magic that happened from the snippet, which I think might have been an impromptu sort of like thing that he did in a live performance or it was something that he was unable to capture from the actual snippet. Because I think he mentioned something along the lines of um, there's like a girl screaming in a snippet and he was unable to kind of get that and, you know, remake that into his actual bit. So there's loads of different things that happen there that sometimes can affect the what can affect the likelihood of you getting a snippet on the album. Because, you know, an artist might think that, you know, once a leak is out, they, they owe it to their fans to do something new or they get annoyed that they had that song is already out and the element of surprise is gone because that's part of the allure when it comes to albums and it and again i'm just happy that he hasn't released a single i'm i'm i've never really been a fan of the whole like artist putting out singles so there's some people that need to do it i'm pretty sure you know if you're maybe a younger artist or smaller artist coming up no less lesser known let's say not younger or smaller but let's say lesser known artists coming up maybe leaks will kind of help you or little snippets or little singles or guest features maybe i'd do if i was an artist i might do a few guest features jump on people's tracks coming up and just do that thing uh, or or do like the sort of Travis Scott thing where when you do a feature you ask someone to send you the stem so that you can fuck up and tweak the bit that you're going to be on so it sounds like a stamp you know it's sort of stamped to your sort of thing because you know when Travis Scott's going to rap you can really sense it the first two or three bars before he starts on his verse right because he tweaks you know tweaks the verb he tweaks the bass maybe removes a hi-hat some distortion there that underwater sound like loads of really cool things happen there um, but yeah hopefully we see the album dropping I'm assuming Thursday Friday when albums usually do drop so um, the fingers crossed we get that fingers crossed it's not a single and I'm interested to see where he goes in terms of sound um, how far can he push it because I thought Die Lit in my opinion you know from track 1 to, to 10 or whatever it was was maybe one of his most concise and uh, well put together projects that you might have seen from like a hashtag mumble rapper in it um, what was it yeah 1 to 19 and it was basically pretty perfect and I think there's rumours out there that supposed to be it's going to be a deluxe of this as well so we're going to get the addition of this well we probably we probably will get I was, I'm going to assume we'll get maybe 15 tracks 12 to 15 and then the rest will be deluxe so it'll be another 19 I can't imagine Playboy Carty wanting to put out 20 tracks plus a deluxe he doesn't te- he doesn't seem like that kind of person that likes to um, give his fans too much music right he likes to give them enough but not too much so like you know so you have that sense of longing you know that you want to wait for some of the stuff to come out so that should be cool um, but yeah, let's hopefully see that coming out. Yeah, I'm not assuming. I'm looking at it now from Dial It. Dial It was 19 tracks. So I can assume, yeah, I'll say 12 to 15 
we're going to get on a whole lot of red, which I'm assuming is still the title. I don't know if it is changed the title of it, but obviously it's a whole lot of red. Um, cause he said that on a few tracks, maybe it's just like a reference. Maybe it's a, it's a, like a, a point of view, a methodology, a way of thinking. I don't know, but let's hope we get that very, very soon. Um, it would be good if we get that soon as well, cause it would, it would help to make these days a little bit more different than what they are in it. These groundhog days that we're having at the moment. So hopefully we have an update on that. So